Hello, welcome to the vlog of a lifetime. This is just another getting my life together, social media gives me anxiety vlog. I feel like since I'm not traveling as much and dating and talking to a million people and trying to have friends and whatever, I feel like I can finally get my life together and heal myself from all the traumas that I have endured. Physically, emotionally, mentally, and physically and emotionally. So to start this vlog, because this is gonna be me getting my life together, okay, part two. I'm gonna show you some new beauty products that have rocked my world, are going to rock my world, and that I'm excited to try. And they are all from Revolve Beauty because that's literally the only place now I shop for beauty stuff because either Sephora has stuff sold out or I'm just like always up on Revolve in general. This shirt is actually Revolve. I wanna do like a whole little try on for you guys for this month. This shirt is so cute, but like. Also my necklace is Vanessa Mooney, George the Jeweler, eight other reasons. So these are some beauty products that I got from Revolve Beauty. This I actually am getting for a friend because I already purchased it and I have it in my freezer. This is the Skin Gym Ice Coolie. Put it in your freezer and then in the morning when you wake up, when you're puffy or you had a night out drinking, whatever it is, you just kind of want to like chisel up the face. This, I just roll upwards motions all over my jaw, all over my face, my forehead. It just like cools like everything down. Also when I wasn't feeling good or when I have like a headache or something like that, I don't really get headache, but like when I'm just like was feeling under the weather because I was sick last week, I literally took this out of my freezer and I just rolled this all over my face. It's just like one of the most amazing beauty products that I've added to my regime. So I love this. It's not that expensive for like like a facial tool that's like really heavy duty. Wash it, wipe it down, whatever, good to go. Another thing that I got from the Skin Gym, this is just so life-changing for me ever since I started using this. They say that these stainless steel gouaches are way better than the rose quartz ones because if you do not get like a real stone or rose quartz, rock is porous and crystal is porous. There's holes in it. If you wash it, water can get into the like porousness of the rock or stone and it can create bacteria and then you're rubbing it on your face every day. I would not recommend that do your research do your own research stainless steel is just like super easy to clean and wash this is the most insane tool i love just in the morning when i wake up i love just starting from my chin and working my way back i use this here I like i can literally do a whole new morning skincare routine for you guys especially since i'm like fighting breakouts and acne right now as you guys can see in my last vlog i was having like a really 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 bad breakout from not sleeping drinking and eating like shit so hot girl summer if you have been been going hot girl summer without these you need these now so because it is so humid and warm out and I'm sweating at night in the club or like when I'm out for drinks or whatever I'm just always hot because LA gets very 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 warm from July to like September I need some volumizing hairspray girl we don't just need regular hairspray we need volumizing hairspray so I picked this up from the way Mmm, smells so good. Cute. And then it adds like texture within the hair. So then throughout the night, you can just like poof your hair up and like it'll kind of like stick because you have the texturing texture in your hair. Hot girl summer and loving yourself and spending alone time with yourself and being with just you all the time means that like lighting candles is a big part of your life. Well, that is for me. I don't know about you, but I love lighting candles. This, I've actually met the CEO of this brand. My best friend, Sam Glam, does my hair. She also does this girl's hair when she comes to town. She started this line and it's basically out of Malibu and this is called the Skylight Fragrance Candle and it just smells like fresh lilacs. Like it smells so good. So I got a candle. Obviously you guys we're beautifying ourselves. We've got some volume spray. We've got some gua sha freaking stainless steel we got a candle and because i've been so sweaty and so oily i probably look really oily right now like look so oily i got this super goop now i've worked with super goop before this is not sponsored by any means their products are literally the best i actually have their super goop body sunscreen on my neck and my chest why i'm like shiny i'm not wearing shimmer at all it's literally sunscreen i just noticed that for my face when i was wearing sunscreen it was making my skin really 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 dewy like i was constantly 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 powdering my face and like touching up my face no we don't want to do that this mineral matte sunscreen insane 40 spf i just used it today and actually i'm so happy normally by this point with two hours of my makeup on i would be an oil sleek and i am pretty dewy but like i don't need to like fully set my face again like i need to literally re fully set my face every time i wear just like regular sunscreen underneath my makeup what is going on with my hair matte super goop is 
because I had a bad breakout and there's things going on in the air and people are getting sick again and it's just like all this stuff. I got a new beauty blender. So this is a little blue one. So fresh beauty blender. I got this new R & Co Television Perfect Hair Shampoo. Let's see what it says about it. Perfect hair shampoo gives you everything you need for the small screen body shine, strength, softening, smoothing. Ooh, I don't know if this will work for volume. This is why we call it perfect. Apply to roots and work through ends. Okay, so we'll see how this goes. Let's smell it. Mmm. Smells so good. Okay. Okay, well, a lot of this is very like bad bitches on her own shit type stuff. So I got these blue light glasses. These are brand new. I thought these were super cute. They're just like clear. Oh my God, these are so cute. So I just wanna like take these and keep these in my bag. So when I'm working on my phone, my laptop, editing pictures, videos, all that kind of stuff, I can just pop these on and we're good to go. Love some new blue light glasses. Another skincare essential that I wanted to try is the all in one one lactic acid treatment by good jeans it says deeply exfoliates the dull surface of skin for clarity radiance and younger looking skin visibly brightens the appearance of dark spots discolorations instantly plumps the look of fine lines and wrinkles in three minutes skincare doesn't always have to be expensive especially things that you wash off but things that you keep on your skin i think it's very important to make sure that it has good ingredients and it's actually doing something so this has just like pure lactic acid which it says it's one of the most hydrating lactic acid deeply exfoliates the surface layers of skin fresher smoother complexion helps fight buildup of dead skin cells extra sebum which can lead to skin bumps dullness skin congestion blackheads and eventually breakouts kind of need that because like I said, I had been breaking out and hopefully this will help keep the dewiness at bay because my skin has been super dewy. I love Tweezer Man. They're the best with applying like lashes and all that kind of stuff. I have a mini pair that I'm just gonna throw in my travel bag and then this I'm going to keep on my vanity. I got a couple makeup products. This is the Hula Contourist. This is really cool. I have not seen this. It has a mirror, thank G, but then it has all of the best like Hula colors. So it has Hula Light, regular Hula Bronzer, Hula Caramel and Hula Toasted. You get all of the best of the best. And I like that this isn't like super huge. Like the Shade and Light palette is made of thick plastic. It's hard, it's heavy, and I love that palette. But it's so like hard to like take around if you need to. This is just so cute. It's just like great for, this is the Nude Stick in the shade Bondi Bay. And I figured it'd be like a really great cream bronzer. I've been staying away from cream products right now because I've been so oily. This is gonna be bomb for winter and I just needed a new one because my Fenty Beauty one is getting really cheesy. So I was like, let's get a new cream bronzer that's just like matte and can slap on. This palette looked really pretty. This is the Venus XL 2 by Lime Crime. And it basically just like has all these really pretty shimmer colors in it. I really love that. Yeah, it just has some really, really, really pretty like shimmers. I feel like I would use this brown a lot. And then this champagne color and then this white as like inner corner highlight, fire. And last but not least, I got a lip liner. And this is by Terry and it's in the color Perfect Nude, which we love to hear that. We love a perfect nude ever since you guys know the Marc Jacobs lip liner and nudist has been off the shelves you cannot get it anywhere I've even tried looking at eBay I've tried looking at Amazon I don't trust anyone I literally miss it so much I should DM them and ask if it's ever gonna come back anyways this is a nude lip liner let's put some on let's just see how it looks Oh, it literally matches the exact lip liner I'm wearing. Okay, so sorry that was really long. That's all for the beauty products that I just got. Let's get into this vlog. It's gonna be all about beauty. I'm gonna get my nails done, hang out with my girls, get a facial. Let's do it. If you guys are liking this video, make sure you're giving it a thumbs up. You are halfway through the video, so give it a thumbs up. Subscribe for more if you're not subscribed and you're just sitting back watching this video. I see you, I see you, I see you in the analytics. I can see where you are and I can find you and then tell you to subscribe and then I know who you are. And anyways, let's get into the vlog. What's up? Good morning. I'm on my way to the nail salon. I'm actually like pulling up right now. I like don't wanna take off my chrome nails but I have to because one of them's about to break and my nails are gross underneath. I'm also gonna get a pedicure. Last night I slept like shit. I'm like a little sad about something, but like I shouldn't be that sad. God is probably doing me a favor, so I shouldn't be that sad, but I kind of am. So anyways, I'm gonna make myself cute. Get a cute little mani patty quality day. I'm gonna go do my nails. Hopefully feel a little bit better when I'm done. 
All right, checking in. I was like, you know what? I'm just gonna let my nails breathe. And I know putting gel on nails is not letting them breathe, but it's better than like a thick acrylic and I'm just gonna let them grow out for like a week or so. So I just did candy apple red by OPI. I should've just done clear, but whatever, stubby red nails. And then I did the classic pink, light pink toe. Doing my nails, feeling cute. Next week, I already know what I'm gonna do for my nails, which is like really good because I normally never know what I'm gonna do. But I'm actually really excited to do my nails next week and get my long acrylics on. I just figured like, I have nothing to really like, I have no big photo shoots or anything coming up for the next week. So I was like, why do I need these like really long, crazy nails if I'm not like filming anything super wild? Cause I like to have my nails on when I'm like doing and shooting like things, you know what I mean? giving these nails a little break from the long acrylic. And later today, I am going down to Newport to go have lunch with my friend and celebrity facialist, Crystal Clear Skin. I'm gonna drive to Newport for a facial because I am breaking out. Pimples here, here. I had a breakout last week all over here. Oh, mm -hmm. my skin still, it like doesn't look horrible. And I haven't really been drinking alcohol. I drank a little bit on Saturday, but yeah. So I'm gonna drive to Newport and go get a bomb facial. I'm gonna take you guys along for all the steps that we do and you can meet Crystal. Yeah, I think it'll be like a really good day. I'm gonna go like makeup list all day and just be cute and I love a little self-care day, a little self-love day. Getting my life together, drinking only once a week, maybe twice a week. It feels just really good because there was a point where I was literally drinking every day. Like literally January, February, March, April, May, June, and then most of July, the first half of July. So I would say the first few days of July and then I was like, after the fourth, I was like, I am done. All right, well, I'll catch you guys up to speed a little bit later today. We're in Newport. Stephanie drove with me. I'm gonna get a facial by the best. I haven't seen a vlog in so long. Oh my God, I just posted one the other day, yesterday. Wow. I mean like I'm like I'm seeing you with the camera in a minute. But... I know. My pen, my pen, look at this way. Skin queen. I know, we're gonna see the skin queen so she can clear up my skin and make me look not as bad as I already look. So your I- skin look, your, your skin looks good. Like, you look well, I, the tech, the complexion's good, but yeah. the breakouts are, is it this? Sure. We're here. Guys, this is step one. Crystal, what does this do, darling? What do we do? So, this is a 3D skin analysis where it's going to pick up all the damage that is underneath the epidermis that you cannot see with the human eye. What? Yes, it takes, based on your results, it will categorize your results and take your true age and compare it with your skin age as well. <laughs> and then we're just gonna repeat that on each side. We're all wow. done here, isn't that so cool? <gasps> I wish your hair was behind your ear, but it's Ew. fine. I'm so ugly. <laughs> Girl, I wish if I got in there, my Stop. acne would look like horrendous. Okay. Oh my God, perfect. look at the pictures that it takes. Look how clear the photos are. You've never had this done? No. Okay, well, you're about to expose yourself, to know. <laughs> I just see one set. <laughs> no, one, right there. two, oh. three. Okay. three. You want the good news or the bad news? Bad. No, we'll go in order. So this oh is detecting God. your spots, okay? So this is brown and red spots on the surface visible to the human eye. Only in this mask area though, okay? Okay. So you're based on, again, 100 is what you want. You're in the 50 per, 52 percentile based on your age group and category, okay? Wrinkles, it's only picking up the deeper set wrinkles here. So you're really great. You're in the 86 percentile. Oh, so it's good. So I'm not 80 percent wrinkled. No, 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 no. If you were if it was really bad, you'd be lower. Tector is really great. Your your pores are not that it, you no, know I'm large. Right. The fewer the pores, the better. So this is the only part Pretty where you want long. yeah. And so it's only picking up the larger pores. Yep, Do you see that? Yes. Yeah. And mm -hmm. then this is the UV spots. Okay. So actually the lower Hardly here, any. no, the lower here, the better. Oh, she, <laughs> you're oh, in 98 percentile. So and look at look at that melasma that it's picking up right there. What is that? What's melasma? It, it, it's like a hormonal discoloration too. Wow. But and then these just mean that the darker ones are really right underneath the surface and they will resurface in a few years. Oh, and like show spots. Mm -hmm. So I'm like 100% UV damage. Yeah, you're a white girl. You you pick up more UV ray damage, unfortunately. Really? So you have to wear 
sunscreen Ooh, at so all time. I want to see mine then because okay. I know this is the brown spot. So this is you want to be lower too? Yeah. But wow, I look like I'm dead. This is your real, look at your broken capillaries on oh, your eyelids. So I know. Yeah. But I just I want to I wonder what this dark shadowing is. Do you have sunscreen? On, is your was your face clean? No, I'm wearing a ton of sunscreen right now. Oh, oh. you are. I'm wearing like four layers. Oh, oh. that's the sunscreen then. Oh. oh. Okay, I thought you had absolutely nothing on. No, I before so I started driving to yours, I put on sunscreen. So then this won't be as accurate because oh it's picking shit, up the block it. But mm. but hey, your sunscreen was only protecting you here. Oh, good to know. Oh wow. Yeah. And yeah. I put it all over. No, it's only protecting you right there. So it picked up the sunscreen. We can also do a simulation on what you would look like as you age. Let's see. So, In yes. Uh huh. <gasps> <laughs> Actually. <laughs> okay, so this is you now. It's yeah, I'm youthful. 38. So as you can see, when we age, mm. we seem. It's actually not that bad because if I if I get like um a facelift mm -hmm. here and here, it you would help like that. Already talking about yeah. What's that? 58. 58. 68, 78, and 80. And we wow. sink and we sag when we age. Isn't that so crazy? It's sad. Wow. But I can show you what injectables could do. Okay. Injectables we just act so like a little cool. pillow and soften everything up. Let's take a look at your true skin age. Okay, your actual age is 28. Your true skin 37. age on your right side is 26. Oh. Good job. What? With that much UV damage? Okay, but you have sunscreen really on, good. so no, it, it didn't have that accurate. So do you think I would have a lower age, maybe? Maybe. Without maybe. all the melasma? So that's your right view, and then this is your left view. So 26. So your what's okay. great is like, look, okay, so this is you now. If you do absolutely nothing to your skin and don't use your skincare products, your skin in four, two to four months will go from this to that. Wow. Do you see how like your pores? When it, see, this is all up, but this is why I'm coming to you because mm -hmm. drinking has literally yeah. caused my texture. Yeah. Ew, look at my nose hair. Ew, I'm disgusting. <laughs> <laughs> Time to reverse my age and be young forever. Steamer. Janelle, you're about to enjoy a crystal clear facial. <sighs> Make me, instead of 26, 24. Or even 20. 20, please. <laughs> Honestly. First, we cleanse. The magic hands. and exfoliating you right now and prepping your skin so that we can you know put a nice little chemical exfoliant to really get you glowing this is a triple acid blend oh god that just really removes all that top layer of dead skin and you really st see the true benefit of this peel janelle like two weeks later oh really why two weeks later because it just continues to work it goes underneath the dermis but it's one of those peels that does not uh, disrupt the barrier and that's why you don't peel like your traditional chemical peels oh. Oh. So it's like a no peel peel. Do you kind of prefer doing this to people? I do. Okay. And I've really seen this paired with the hydrofacial is just a secret sauce. Really? <laughs> yeah. Listen, ladies, the neck will show your age. Mm -hmm. I have a veiny neck. I've always had a very veiny neck. Even when I was a little girl, like a little kid, my neck was very veiny. It's so funny. I was watching my old vlogs from when I was like 24. Mm -hmm. My neck looked older. Really? When I was yeah. 24. Yeah. Well, you've been stuff. using your intensive alpha ret. It's there. I think I almost reversed my age more because yeah. I think when I was younger, I think my skin mm -hmm. would have been worse. Yeah. I always tell everyone that your your 30, 40, 50 year old selves will thank you for using a retinoid when you start at a younger age. Oh yeah, I've mm -hmm. not been good about that honestly. I need to get a retinoid from you too. You feel the spice? A little but, bit. It's not. But you can handle it with the fan, huh? Oh yeah, and honestly, it's it's literally not bad at all. Yeah. Wow, I look like a glazed donut. I feel like I'm in a spaceship. So the blue light helps kill bacteria. That's it's what really it is. It's really great for oily, acne-prone skin. Um, the green Ooh. light is green light helps with inflammation. Oop, time. Pink light is red and blue mixed together. So oh, yeah, it's bacteria anti-aging. Yep, it's pink to the human eye. Talk loves 
this. Mm, they love it. Right? Oh my god, so cooling. All right, so you guys get up out of bed and then you shop all the skincare that'll make your skin clean and crystal clear. So why you make it hard, hard for me? Yeah. Good love, good love. Baby, it's all that I need. I'm telling you. Good love, good love. You know what it's gonna be. 